Hello guys. In this lecture, we'll see how to create plant as we already created company and company code, which is a finance related part, but just for practicing purpose, we have to create it to not to stop our testing or testing scenarios or configuration part. In this lecture, we'll see how to create plant. Plant is nothing but where the actual manufacturing is taking care or taken out. Okay. So to create the plant, we have to we use the same T code SPRO. Click on enter, then SCP reference IMG, click on enterprise structure, then definition, then go to the logistic general and click on define, copy, delete, check plant. If you don't want to follow this plant, you can directly use the T code OX10. Same way you can put here OX10 and click on enter. Same window will open, which is opening now. Okay. So click on define, define plant. If you want to define fresh plant, you can use this option. Otherwise, you can easily copy from the already available plant or standard plant. Same way, just copy and change the information. But in this lecture, we'll create or define the fresh plant. Okay. Click on new entry. Here plant name, you can put UK01. And pressing here as plant one. Plant name is also name two is also plant one. Okay. Factory calendar, you can choose. Whichever factory calendar available for India, I will update that. Okay. Click on enter. Once you click on enter, click on the address tab to fill more details. Name I will put here plant one. Okay. Search term also I am provide, providing the same one, plant one. Title you can provide company or as per the drop down, whichever you want, or you can keep it blank also. For reference, I put in company. You can update the address for the plant. Street number three. For example, I am updating here. Okay. Postal code. Okay. Country code is IN. Region is Maharashtra. This address and all these things will be provided by your business during the business gathering process in the implementation phase. So same details you have to just update it because we are just mapping the enterprise structure which is actually available from that company to the SAP system. Okay. Telephone number you can provide, mobile number you can provide, or email ID you can also provide. Direct Gmail. Okay. You can preview this all the things. This is how address will look formatted address. If you want any changes, you can do it. Otherwise, click on enter or continue and save. save the changes in our respective transport request and you can see data is saved this plant we can check in the table if you go to the ac 16 and put the table t001w enter and our plant which is uk01 execute you will see data is updated against the plant this is uk01 we put name address all these details you can check in this table okay so if thousand plants are there no need to check one by one just go to this table and execute so this way we can create the plant thanks guys